Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of The Lies of P. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am, and today we're going to continue exploring the city of Krat, or what's left of it, at least. But before we do... Like always, let's talk about everything I did off screen, and I did only a couple of things. I went ahead and leveled up this two dragon sword to plus four to see how it plays, like how much damage it'll do, if it's a good sword or not. Uh, so we'll see. If it's not, then we'll switch back over to our other sword. But it looks really cool, and I want to try it out. All right, now that that's all been said, let's go ahead and get started. First things first, we're going to go visit that robot. Oh, also, I did listen to the record. Let's go over to the robot and see if we can't uh, talk to him and teach him how to be human a little more. What did you come to tell me? Huh? Being angry for someone else's sake? I think it's brave. I hope I find someone I can be brave for. Thank you so much. Hello, my only friend. Um, and there was something else. Oh, that's right. Uh, the Krat Central Station. But didn't we... I think we need to go over here. We have a door that we couldn't open because we didn't do the riddle yet. And I think it's over in the Krat Central Station lobby. Where was it? Was it over here? I think it was right over here. Absolutely. That's even better. And we forgot to put another amulet on. Let's put this one on. I want to see that new costume. Oh, that looks so dope. I like it. I like it a lot. Now we're looking spiffy. I know in the trailers they showed off this outfit. Um, let's go to the beginning of Krat Central Station here. We need to find her partner. 
and I was scoping it out before I started recording and I think down here is it down here I'm a human, just a soldier. Okay, yeah, he did do his dialogue again. So I ran through here. Luckily, he did his dialogue again. Uh, I was running all through this area, and I came about right here and then heard somebody talk, and I was like, oh, shit, what the fuck? So I just, like, stopped, and I was like, hopefully, you know, that doesn't mess things up. Uh, but he, he redid his dialogue. Thank goodness. Uh, I think this is her companion. Even though, like, to me, he doesn't look like a soldier. So, I don't know. We'll see. What? Are you a stalker? Name's Atkinson. Croat militia. The suburbs are sealed off. There's no escape. Communications cut off too. Someone planned this all out. No idea who. Above my pay grade. Well, if you meet someone named Bell in the city, tell her Atkinson died. A soldier. <laughs> Okay, let's go back and tell Bell. Good to see you. I was getting worried waiting this long. The situation here seems to be getting worse. Soldiers like me are blunt. So give it to me straight. Is... is my partner... safe? Uh, I'm gonna say that he was killed. Savor the misery. This... this is Atkinson's handwriting on the letter. When we came to Krat, I never thought it would end like this. Sometimes you meet people who make you believe they'll always be with you. But a life can be snuffed out at any moment. I need to stay alive to notify others of his death. But it feels like something inside me has died as well. Anyway. I appreciate knowing what happened. I mean it. I'm sorry, Belle. That sucks. Sometimes the brightest lights that shine burn out the quickest. Oh, damn. That's messed up what they did to that painting. Let's uh, use the piano. Oh, let's pet the kitty cat. I'm loving this new outfit. 
I might take the glasses off though. I'm not really digging them too much. Oh, wow. Looks really cool. I don't even know which way to go. Who would have guessed all this was beneath the hotel? Wait. Is this the relic of Trismegistus? You know, it's the strangest feeling. I, I, I think I've been here before. Uh, maybe I haven't gotten all my memories back after all. I don't know exactly what's going on, but someone was dragged away from here. We have to follow. Hurry! Okay, so this must be the way to progress. I want to check out the other way first. This katana looks cool. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Butterfly is going to lead me into a damn trap. I know it. Oh, no. There's a bunch of them. Come here. Okay, there's no more now. Man, this katana looks so cool. Uh puppets. Ow. I need to be careful for traps. I almost stepped on another one. I think. Yep. I think that's everything over here. Oh, you're a big boy, aren't you? Ah, that's so lame.
You better give me something good for killing you, bud. Iron wall amulet. I bet that's uh, for defense. Yep. That's cool, though. Cursed Knight's Halbred. Um, that does not sound good. Oh, yeah. If those things. Oh, hey. say no because I mean everything is attacked me you know I'm just defending myself Um, can we open up the surprise box? Oh, wow. What an asshole. That was close. There's a box down there too. Uh. No. All right, attempt number two. Bastard puppet. Hmm.
he doesn't see me. This is awesome. Uh, and that's a boss. There's the ladder. Get up there, Mr. Wayne. Get up there, quick. Don't step on the trap. Half moonstone. Where you at? Yeah, just keep walking. Keep walking, bud. find out what this boss is here in just a second oh man is this the black rabbit brotherhood I have a feeling it is Even if we're just baits to buy time, you're going down. Ah, uh, no. Save our brother. That's when our fate was sealed. Oh God, is that what I think it is? Damn, that was that was quite a fight. But I do, I do, ooh, 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 love this sword, man.
I give up. Just don't kill me. Hmm. Sure about that? Oh, amazing. I didn't expect you to thrash those rabbit fellows, too. You're here looking for Geppetto, aren't you? The fox and the cat have got that old man. They took the submarine from that dock over there. They probably went to the alchemist's isle. There should be another one. You should commandeer it. If anyone asks, uh, I didn't see anything. There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, uh, I didn't see anything. Oh. <laughs> Good choice. I, Alidoro, am too great a treasure hunter to just disappear. My admirers would wonder. See for yourself. I sell only the best treasure. Um... Nah, nothing new, I guess. There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. Let's ask him about his uh, ad identity. Right. <laughs> I had a feeling you would ask sooner or later. It's because of that girl, isn't it? I am not Alidoro the Hound. Not the real one, anyway. I used to be Alidoro's partner. I admired him, to be honest. <laughs> he was amazing. Amazing at everything, except making a profit, that is. But he didn't need to cut me off just because I sold some antiques. I mean, what's a few antiques when you've got bills to pay? We argued. One thing led to another, and I had to kill him. And stealing his identity was the logical next step. My original code name is Parrot, after all. Fitting, isn't it? Oh, he was also from the country of the morning. Maybe he shares some blood with the girl. And that's my story. Tragic tale. Do you want to hear more? There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see... I'm just a guest here. With no special obligation to the hotel. But if you still want to hear... <laughs> the alchemist said they would help me escape from the city. Talk about an offer I couldn't refuse. I can't live in the hotel forever. I need to move up and move on. Also, there was someone who was so annoying. That's all. Does that suffice? There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. Man, I definitely want to kill this guy. I'm kind of conflicted. I'm just going to do it. I'm going to do it, everybody. Oh, what a murderous air you have. You're going to kill me? I know what you are. You're Geppetto's puppet, aren't you? If someone isn't trying to kill you, you can't hurt them either. That limitation makes it seem like your creator didn't trust you very much. Smart of him. So, what will it be, Mr. Handsome Idiot? Leave quietly? Or shut up and buy something? You, you've got to be joking! Don't come any closer! Easiest fight ever. Ooh, great Vanini's collection. Did we? Where are we? Total attack. The Black Rabbit Brotherhood, the Fox, the Cat, and Alidoro, too. I don't even want to guess what they might be planning, pal. This way must lead to their headquarters, shall we? We need to find a stargazer. Resembles. Yes, it seems 
we can use it to call a submarine. Listen, pal. Nice landing, but, uh, let's not make it a habit. What the...? Hey, it's... Sophia. I am finally meeting you here. You're a clever one, so it shouldn't surprise you that the Sophia at the hotel isn't really me. My real self is on the upper part of the Abbey. I became his tool a long time ago. I have endured such pain. My soul split into pieces. Truth is, I guided you this far not to save Krat, but to save me. I felt guilty about that. But I was so elated when you answered my call. Despite it all, I thank you. My spirit and my body have lived apart for too long. Perhaps in death, they will reunite. In peace, I'll grant you my power before my spirit diminishes further. Stargazer will guide you, clever one. If you find my body, please help me find peace. My guidance ends here. After images of memories rage on the seaside because of Ergo, please be careful. I can't hold out forever, but I'll support you. I am the daughter of Valentinus, leader of the Alchemists. Simon was my father's right-hand man. Ambition overwhelmed him, however, and he spread the petrification disease, taking countless lives. Why would he do that? I don't know. But he brings a dark world upon us, that's for certain. Stop him, however you can. The petrification disease freezes time and memory within the afflicted body. Ergo is the purified essence of that life, trapped by the petrification disease. When I discovered that, it opened my eyes, and I was able to manipulate time using Ergo. Simon, on the other hand, is trying to use my power to fuel his ambition. I wound back your time to protect you so you could stand against him. So stop him. Save Krat. Damn. How far can we go? Okay, I didn't think so. Can we break this? Nope. Oh, what the fuck is going on? A 
Romeo as in the Puppet King? Hi. Are you trained to be a stalker too? Well, let's practice together. Call me Lampwick. Oh, holy shit. I didn't even notice that up there. He didn't even come to your graduation. <sighs> I don't care if an old man like that kicks the bucket. Don't say that. It's nice you got any family at all. Let's not talking about this. Oh, she's here. Grab her. So many uh, goodies just lying about. This is definitely going to be a longer episode. I have no clue where a stargazer is. And I don't want to skip over any of this dialogue. Please teach me how to use a sword. You're a legendary stalker. Ugh. So annoying. Germany, get rid of them. I'm off. Hey, there's somebody up there. Maybe it's Geppetto. Just making sure I'm not missing any goodies. There's one over there. Oh, damn. One of those scorpion guys. Uh, there was a bunch of those scorpions. There's like two or three of them. Let's grab this. And then we're going to repair this. And let's go back to Hotel Karat. We have a uh, thing to listen to as well. But first, let's talk to everybody here. I heard a rumor from a recent arrival. Is Alidoro truly dead? I don't know what to think. 
I didn't get to repay him yet. Honestly, I did think it was strange. The more I saw of him, the more different he seemed from the person I knew. I wonder what the real Alidoro was like. It's hard to believe. How could the fake Alidoro harm the real one? I had my suspicions, though. He just seemed so much more vicious than the man who saved me. I guess I'll never know who the real hero was. I wanted to repay him, at least a little. Thanks for telling me, though. I know he's dead and at peace, so I can memorialize him. It's the least I can do. You are here. Um, I have to check out uh, the. Ooh, yeah. Let's upgrade our dagger. And then we're gonna talk to Vanini. I can hardly believe it, but the ergo readings you gathered leave no doubt. No doubt at all, you see? Okay, Vanini, breathe. Despite your best efforts, they can't read your mind yet. My friend, my apologies. But when you hear this news, you'll be excited too. The puppets were being compelled by the Grand Covenant. But they were communicating with each other, with wavelengths. This is beyond anything I'd imagined. They were not built with this kind of intelligence. I did the best I could to decipher the wavelengths, but there was considerable noise in the signal. Care to give it a listen? Carlo, I hope you can hear me. The laws of the Grand Covenant bind us. We're his puppets. First law. All puppets must obey the Creator's commands. Law Zero. The Creator's name is... Geppetto. Giuseppe Geppetto. Ah, did you hear that? The last part sounded important, but there was too much static. Ah, tell me you heard it, please. We need to find the cause of the frenzy and... This may be our best chance. What or who was behind the frenzy? Oh, I'm gonna say Geppetto. Damn it, man. This is probably bad. Geppetto? Lo Zero, the creator's name is Geppetto. One can't make these things up. It must be true. That was the cause of the frenzy. But why would Geppetto of all people do this? I suppose we'll never find out if we don't save him. I have to admit it's good to have things in motion again. I was beginning to despair. Now that we know the cause, we can find a solution. And it's all thanks to you, my friend. I always welcome... Che bello! A brand new design! No, a whole new model! What a thrill! And there we are. Done. Even a brand new model doesn't stand a chance when you're dealing with genius. But the device bordered on genius itself. Required all my intellect. If you ever meet the creator, get me their calling card, won't you? No. Oh. Sorry, I'm sure you're busy. Just let me know if you ever find out.
I always welcome. Not switch, uh, modify. What other one would I want to modify? Maybe fire? Yeah, we'll do that. Then we'll give the uh, box to this guy. At the house of Vanini. Ah, Master Vanini's collection box. You have been busy, sir. The house of Vanini deals only in masterpieces and works of special genius, sir. And I'm pleased to say that for you, the private reserve is open. At the house of Vanini. Oh, yes, let's grab this stuff up. We'll grab this as well. I'm not even going to buy these cranks. I'm not, I'm not even using them. So, um, I'll, I'll just leave them alone. Is there anyone else to talk to? Vanini? We just talked to you. We all owe you a huge debt. Or we will. If we can stop the frenzy. You may not be aware. Uh, I am an orphan. In fact, my parents were murdered before my very eyes. The authorities in Krat insisted it was a mugging, but I know what I saw. A mad, raving puppet killed them. A puppet that was driven by a murderous lunatic's awakened ego. I know that because the lunatic told me his name. Arleghino. I'll never forget his insane laugh. I have been fitting puppets with the Grand Covenant to ensure no one else ever has to experience the same tragedy I did. I was this close to giving up. But now that you're here, you can take the Wavelength Decoder. It's proof of your brilliant actions. See what else you can read with it. You might even discover more secrets within the Puppet King's message. You can play it back as much as you like. Just use the Stargazer. Here. I always welcome friends. So the dude that we were doing the riddles for murdered Vanini's parents. That's interesting. So puppets in Ergo... All of that with Geppetto and everything was before Vanini. That's interesting. That is very interesting. All righty, everyone. This is where we're going to end the video. I want to start by telling everybody sorry that the video is so long. I apologize. Hopefully it wasn't too long for everybody. But also, I'd like to say thank you very much for stopping by and watching the video. It really does mean a lot to me. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did... Go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world, Mr. John Wayne, signing off.